Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to unbox and do a review about APC BX 600 CIN UPS. I personally tested the duration of how much longer it can hold up the power during the power outage. I tell them about that later in this video. My first UPS product was Zebronic Zeb U725 UPS. The Zebronic is a cheap China product. If you are planning to buy a UPS for your PC, never buy that one no matter what. If your computer load is higher or even normal for that matter, it can handle it even for a 3 seconds. That is why I ordered this UPS from Amazon. It's made in India. As you guys can guess, India only manufacture good quality items. This UPS is actually a beast compared to my old UPS. This UPS has surge protection which will protect your computer and other devices from sudden spikes in voltages. And also it has an automatic voltage regulator. It will keep the voltage stable enough to keep your device safer. These two main features are almost guaranteed to protect your device from electricity problems. You guys can rest easy since it can protect your devices. I still remember when my old adapters were burned back then when I didn't have any UPS for my computer. That was the worst day of my life, but now I can use my computer in peace. The beeping sound will no longer will be annoying because the sound will be lower but noticeable. So you will know it's running in UPS power but it also it won't give you a headache. The best thing is they give a 2 year battery warranty, amazing right? Not many brands are offering these services. They say it's fast charging like 4 to 6 hours in hours, seriously? I wouldn't say that as a fast, you know. But as for the information, it never felt like that long to charge the battery. After all, UPS is used for saving our data safely whenever a power outage occurs. You can see some of the standard calculation about the average backup time in the box but it will be different for you and others depending on their computer setup and devices. The more power your computer consumes, the lesser backup time you will get. Inside the box, you will only get a manuals and UPS and then signed test sheet. This shows that they will test every UPS they manufacture before selling it, which is a good thing. You can see there are two buttons. As you guys can guess, the first big button is power button and the next one is battery saver button. This battery saver button actually has a key role in keeping your battery's lifespan longer. If you use this feature, it will cut your backup time in half. For example, if you are normally getting a 20 minutes backup time, if you enable the battery saver option, it will only give you a 10 minutes power backup. This is a small price to pay for your UPS battery's lifespan. The third one is actually an LED. It's actually there to identify your battery's condition. If it shows green, that means it is charging. If it shows red, that means you have to replace your battery. This UPS has a battery self-test. So it can find if the battery is faulty or it needs to be replaced. So it will show you the red LED if it needs to be replaced. And if there is no LED, that means it is fully charged and nothing to worry about. It has some air flow holes on every side for air circulation and its wire is kind of small but it's okay I guess because most of us will use the UPS nearby to our devices anyway so it's not that big of a deal. You can connect up to 3 devices, I usually connect my CPU and monitor and then speaker. I already tested its backup time, here's my computer's specification. I have i7 10th generation processor, GTX 1050Ti graphics card and 24 inch monitor. I was listening to the song on Spotify on my desktop while the power outage occurred and I got around 13 minutes power backup. And when I tried to use the battery saver option, I only got around 6 minutes of power backup. I guess it's the best UPS you can find in the low budget. Because it can even handle low power devices such as internet modems. Unlike my other old UPS, it couldn't even handle low power consumption devices. Yes, I am talking about my previous China UPS. The worst one ever. But I am happy with this UPS though. To be honest, it's the best in my opinion. I have given the link in the description below so you guys can buy this product if you want. 
And I hope this helps you guys. Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments below and subscribe to our channel. And I'll see you guys in the next video. And bye.